Hey y'all, I'm Dominique. Welcome or welcome back to my channel, Nine Rule Rule Seven. Here, where I discuss all things fragrance related, and I will occasionally be posting my luxury goods, my handbag collection, offering some self help tips, and everything in between. So, if that sounds like something you're interested in, then please consider subscribing to my channel. <music> Today, you guys, I'm going to be unboxing my Coach Tabby Jelly. Oh, my God. They are the cutest bags ever. And I used to wear the jelly bean shoes when I was a kid. So, that brings back so many memories. I even bought a pair for my baby <laughs> because they are so, so cute. I just love them. And they come in a variety of colors. The handbags do. But purple happens to be my favorite color. So, I had to get me a purple one. <laughs> So this is a gift to myself for my birthday. My birthday was May 27th. Hey, all the Gemini's. <laughs> so I, I normally buy myself a nice handbag, a nice perfume whenever I reach a milestone in life or either when I have a birthday or if I just feel like celebrating myself. So I love me. And what better way to show me that I love me than treating me? <laughs> To all the moms out there who are working so hard to provide for our children, make sure that you take time to celebrate yourself, you love on yourself, and you gift yourself something. <laughs> and even if you're not a mom, if you're an aunt, if you're a cousin, whatever, just make sure that you are taking the time to pamper yourself with something. It doesn't have to be a luxury item or a designer handbag, name brand handbag. It doesn't have to be anything of that nature. Whatever you see fit to get even if it's expensive, treat yourself, okay? <laughs> so I'm gonna go ahead and start by unboxing my package. So I've got it on, I wanna say last Tuesday, and I've really been holding out because I wanted to make sure that I was in the right spirit to record. I was a little down because it was my birthday and my mom, of course, she passed away from cancer last year. She normally would call me and just sing to me and wish me the happiest of birthdays. So I was a little down, but I did get a chance to go on me a, a trip with my friend to, to New Orleans and it was so good and it kind of helped me a little bit, kind of get my mind off of it. So that's why I'm kind of late. Um, unboxing this but let me go ahead and get started okay no y'all can't see me unboxing it but okay Ooh, okay let's see all right so when you order from the coach website it actually comes in a nice box with a bow i ordered this from neiman marcus and let me tell y'all something Neiman Marcus had this bag for $350 and about a few days later, probably three days later, I saw that the coach website had it for $240. So that means I could have saved me some coins. <laughs> and like I said, the coach website, it comes with a nice uh, package. It comes with the little bow on the box and uh, Neiman Marcus just throw it in an old bag, baby. But that's okay. So we finna go in here. This is how the plastic look or whatever. We finna go in here and see what it's hidden on. <laughs> okay. Now, even Marcus, y'all need to step y'all game up. Especially for the prices. Okay. Ooh, it's a lot of plastic. Make sure there's no dust get on this one, huh? Oh, my God. Stop playing with me, Lord. Oh, we y'all. Look at that pretty purple. How cute is that, y'all? Oh, and it's a nice size, too. Okay. So, this is the scrap. Yeah. Okay. Let me put this down. This bag is gorgeous, you guys. Okay. Let me get them taking this out. Oh, oh, it don't take off. Oh, you got to do it. So, y'all, did y'all see what I just did? I was kind of trying to pull it up because I'm used to bags like that, but you actually got the Hit the little clasp like this. Okay, take some of this out. Okay, so you have the nice coach duster right here, the dust bag. Put that to the side for a second. And some more tissue paper to, uh, for the bag, just to make sure it holds its shape. And then you have like a little card. Okay. I love it, y'all. How cute is that? And you know something? The pictures 
on the website does not do it justice because this is a gorgeous bag. And I was a little afraid at first because it is a jelly bag. And I remember um, thinking to myself, does it, does it look like a childish bag? Does it look too juvenile? But it actually does not. This is a cute one here, y'all. Okay. So let me see. So you have um, no interior pockets. That's okay. Uh, on the back, I thought I don't know why I thought this was like a slip pocket. Don't know if the camera is picking it up really good. I'm looking at my camera and my mirror, but I thought that this was like a little slip pocket. But no, it's just the um, it's just the coach emblem right here that you can see. If you guys can see it, I'm not sure. Maybe this is a little better. Okay, so I thought that this was a slip pocket. So there's no slip pockets. That would have been so cute to put a little slip pocket on the back of this. But anyway, let me see what the scraps looking like. Okay. That is so cute, y'all. Oh, I am in love with this bag already. So much paper on there. Okay, so this is the scrap right here. That is so cute. And it is adjustable. So I guess if you want to wear it um, as a crossbody, if you want it sitting a little lower on you, that would be perfect for that. And it comes with a little wristlet that I will take this paper off. My God, I love this bag. That purple is doing it for me, baby. I love purple. Uh, maybe I should have. <laughs> maybe I should have. I already had the paper off. But then it wouldn't be a true unboxing, would it? Okay. I'm trying, y'all. Okay. So let's see how it would look as a little wristlet. So let me cl class that back. That, it's just cute just wearing it like this. I think if I wore it like this, it would be more sophisticated. And of course, this is the, the tag on it. You probably can't see it. Um, and this it just has the price on there. So I think wearing this um, as a clutch would be so sophisticated. I love clutches. So let me just see how it will look when I put this um, little wristlet on there. Wristlet scrap. Okay. So that's cute. It's a cute little for a little shindig. Just carrying it around like this. That's adorable. Okay. And I'm thinking about now that I'm looking at the bag, I will probably try to order um a silver chain. I have some silver chains, but they're a bit long. Um, I had some chunky ones that I ordered from Amazon. I think that I would probably try those on this bag, but um I will see. I think silver would go good with this, especially with the silver hardware um, right here. If you can see, that'll be so cute. So let me see what the scrap looking like. Okay. Okay, so that's cute. Okay. And I'm sorry, y'all, if I keep looking in different directions, I'm looking at my mirror. I'm not used to my mirror being placed the way it is, but my original mirror broke on me. Well, I broke it. <laughs> so I love this. Okay, so this comes. It, it, it falls on me a nice bit. Let me show you guys. Let's see what all it can hold. Okay, so don't forget, you guys. You have to open the clasp like this. Just squeeze it versus just rip it doing it like that. Because I, I think you probably can break it. Um, I had to get used to this. I'm used to bags looking like this and you just doop, but you don't do it like you go doop. <laughs> so let's see what all it can fit. I have this very, very cute card case from Marc Jacobs and it's purple and <laughs> lavender, whatever you want to call it. How cute is that, you guys? Just a regular card case. I don't have any cards in there because I put my cards in another card holder, but I'm going to stick that right in here, okay? So, I'm going to try my mini pochette from Louis Vuitton. Um, normally, when I wear this, I have uh, my hand sanitizers, my wet wipes, and um, makeup powder, stuff like that, if I need to kind of freshen up my face. So, I'm going to see if that fits in here comfortably. Okay, and it does. 
see that? That's nice in there. Okay. Um, let me try putting my lip gloss. Just some regular lip gloss. It's travel size perfume of uh, commodity milk. I absolutely love this. Uh, let me try my aquifer. Can't go anywhere without this. My face gets ashy so fast. Uh, let's try some beauty cream from Dove. Stick that in there. Okay, so, so far, this is what we're looking at inside the bag. I hope y'all can see it. This is what we're looking at. This is a, this is the space it has. It's, it's, ooh, it's very spacious. Okay, let me set this up. Some things are falling over. Okay. Let's slide my dental floss in there. Don't go anywhere without a child. I hate having stuff in my teeth. Let's put a cute little hand sanitizer in there. A little lip balm. Okay, and even with all the stuff I have in there, this is it's still enough room to put other items in. So this is all that I have in there right now. And let me mention, I forgot to say that it has a cute little coach tag on the side. Oh, how cute is that? So um, I will put this in here. I probably wouldn't put anything personal or uh, sanitary napkins, anything of that nature, because you definitely is going to see it. <laughs> you definitely will see it. So, um, this is so cute. I'm so glad I got this bag. I love this bag. I only regret that I didn't get it for $240 off the coach website, but I didn't know that it was on sale, but I, I love this bag. And like I said, I can fit way more in here. So let me pause for a call so I can get some more items to see what else can fit. Okay. So you guys, um, I did put my MCM wristlet in there and it fits quite comfortably. And I really have room for my shades or my sunglasses as well. This is a spacious bag for the price. I love it. Now I originally wanted the coach tabby backpack, but it was back ordered and I really wanted my birthday gift now <laughs> i just couldn't wait and i said you know i just may get that later uh because i'm definitely going to get the black one it's so cute the pink one is okay but i'm not really a pink girl i got some pink items but i, I just don't wear it often and i feel like the black will go with anything and I, I can wear it with everything i can dress it up dress it down so that's definitely next on my list and let me just say wow you guys this is a cutie and it is a nice size. I cannot wait to wear this one, y'all. So you guys, that is it for my unboxing slash first impression of this bag. I'm impressed. <laughs> and let me just say, I absolutely love it. If you're considering getting it, um, don't feel like it will be too um juvenile or that you're too mature to wear a jelly bag because i think it's cute and i think that without the scraps it actually can be a sophisticated or classy bag um even with the scraps but if you uh, feel like it's not you know in your age range i don't think so i think that anybody can rock this this is so cute i am so glad i got it i need to find some jelly shoes to go with it so just one last little look at the bag i want to thank you guys for tuning in and viewing my content and once again if you're liking what you see so far then please subscribe have a good one